Have you ever pondered, gazing up at the stars on a clear night, whether life exists on another planet? The galaxy appears eerily silent. As of yet, we haven't detected any signs of life. However, the quest for life beyond Earth has only just begun. Even within our solar system, there's speculation that life may exist independently in several places, such as Jupiter's icy moon Europa or Saturn's shrouded moon Titan. But could there be a planet beyond our solar system where life has thrived, a place we could one day realistically visit? Well, it turns out such a planet might be right next door, a world similar in size to Earth, orbiting the closest star to the Sun, Proxima Centauri. Despite likely radiation bombardment from its star, this neighboring planet could still hold promise in the search for alien life. Welcome to Space Facts. If you enjoy my videos, be sure to subscribe and tap the notification bell to never miss an upload. Proxima Centauri is an intriguing star by any standard. It's part of a triple star system with the main stars, Alpha Centauri A and B, orbiting each other closely. Proxima Centauri, however, is a small, long-lived, low-mass and cool red dwarf star, so dim that it's visible only with a powerful telescope. It's also the closest of the three stars, located just 4.2 light-years away from the Sun. At least three exoplanets have been identified orbiting Proxima Centauri, with two confirmed and one situated within the star's habitable zone. The region where conditions might support liquid water on its surface, such as Proxima b. Proxima b was initially detected in 2016, sparking significant excitement due to its location around its star and its similarity in size and mass to Earth, suggesting it could be a rocky world with Earth-like elements. There was hope and speculation that it might harbor an Earth-like atmosphere and even life on its surface. However, Further research revealed differences between Proxima b and Earth. Despite some similarities, Proxima Centauri being a small red dwarf star, around 14% the diameter of the Sun, means Proxima b orbits much closer to its star, completing a year in just 11.2 Earth days. Despite being smaller, red dwarfs are not calmer. They produce violent solar flares more frequently due to their nuclear fusion processes being closer to their surface, resulting in strong magnetic fields and a chaotic surface. The strong magnetic fields of Proxima Centauri can release intense, high-energy radiation into its surrounding system, bombarding Proxima b with space weather far more violent than what we experience on Earth. Additionally, Proxima b is likely tidally locked in synchronous rotation, meaning one side always faces the star, resulting in perpetual daylight on one side and eternal frozen nighttime on the other, similar to our Moon's relationship with Earth. The sun-facing side of Proxima b would be exposed to high radiation levels and possibly solar flares, like the gigantic flare recorded in 2021, around 100 times more powerful than any in our solar system. Some scientists speculate that these events could gradually erode Proxima b's atmosphere if it has one and eliminate any surface water. Thus, despite being within the habitable zone, the conditions on Proxima b may not be conducive to life as we know it. Proxima b's close orbit around its small star raises doubts about its habitability as it would require a thick atmosphere and a robust magnetic field to withstand extreme radiation, up to 500 times more harmful than what we experience on Earth. Such conditions could strip atmospheres, evaporate oceans and damage DNA on planets orbiting red dwarfs. However, recent Earth climate models suggest that rocky exoplanets around red dwarfs might still be habitable. Scientists used supercomputers to create 3D simulations, revealing potential climates based on specific conditions and environmental changes. Surprisingly, these simulations indicate that Proxima b could maintain habitable conditions despite being tidally locked, with one side exposed to heavy radiation. 
with an atmosphere resembling modern Earth's and a strong magnetic field deflecting extreme radiation, Proxima b might not be a dead world after all. Proxima b may indeed be covered in an ocean extending to its night side, giving it the appearance of a giant eyeball staring into its star from space. However, Proxima b isn't our only option in the search for life. The amount of Proxima b covered by its ocean depends on the salt content in the water, which lowers its freezing point, allowing it to extend into colder regions. Even with high salinity, simulations suggest that Proxima b could harbor an ocean if it has a thick atmosphere and a strong magnetic field. If the right conditions are present, Proxima b could theoretically support life. For example, microbial life thrives in Earth's Dead Sea, despite salt concentrations above 30%. Thick clouds on the star-facing side of Proxima b could act as a massive umbrella, deflecting even more of the star's radiation. Additionally, with a combination of atmospheric and oceanic circulation, warm air and water could transport heat to the cold side, preventing the atmosphere from freezing and creating regions with liquid water, even in perpetual darkness. Indeed, while this research is exciting, it doesn't confirm the presence of atmosphere or water on Proxima b, or whether it ever had any. However, if the exoplanet formed with a significant amount of water, there's a possibility it still persists. It might have initially formed farther away from its red dwarf star and gradually moved closer, providing protection from powerful flares in its early days. Despite conditions likely being very different from Earth, Proxima b could harbor alien life beneath its exotic skies, with landscapes ranging from frozen wastelands to rugged mountains, parched deserts or vast oceans. Only time will reveal the strange and wondrous forms life might take under the glare of its red dwarf star, if life can indeed exist there. If Proxima b proves suitable for life, it could indicate that the galaxy is brimming with similar worlds. After all, red dwarf stars are the most common in the Milky Way, with scientists estimating that 20 out of the 30 closest stars to Earth are red dwarfs. This suggests that life on planets orbiting these dim stars might be commonplace, making us the ones in the galaxy who are truly strange. As it stands, Proxima b has never been directly imaged, and the information we have on this elusive exoplanet is very limited, leading to much speculation. However, with powerful telescopes, we are on the brink of getting our first glimpse of this strange world. The James Webb Space Telescope might detect its atmosphere, and there are plans for tiny laser beam pushed probes to be sent to the Proxima Centauri system, possibly arriving by 2075, a journey that would take humans thousands of years to achieve. Yet the most promising method to see Proxima b soon is through a new ground-based telescope called the Giant Magellan Telescope. Expected to be one of the most powerful ever built on Earth, it will offer a resolution four times greater than the James Webb Telescope. Still under construction, it's estimated to receive its first light in 2029. When operational, researchers predict we'll see Proxima b for the first time, possibly capturing it, orbiting its star, and even analyzing its atmosphere for potential biosignatures. With these advancements, we're on the verge of answering the question of whether Proxima b is capable of hosting life or is merely a sterile rock. The future holds exciting possibilities, and within the next few years, we may finally uncover the truth about our closest exoplanet neighbor. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please tap the like button and subscribe. See you next time.